hello guys this is Mohammed Faisal and in today's video we will gonna learn that how you, you can get exact our display screen width height and what is our screen size we have in our default phone so and let me tell you uh, before you starting the video before starting the tutorial let me tell you that in the next video or in the next tutorial we will we, we uh, i'm gonna teach you, you all that uh, how we can uh, get the uh, how we can get that dis display de uh, densities and how you can work on di different kind of dip, uh, displays with the their uh, ex expect expected de densities and how you can uh, use the dp sgp dp dpsp dp dpi etc on with the, your android component so first let's get started with this one and then we're gonna cover in next video all these things we will gonna cover in the next video so let's get started so open let me open my android studio here is a, i have an empty project here as you can see okay so let's get started first, let me first create and view so type linear layout match fair and prep content i'm just creating in dummies to show you that uh, the text so vertical oh, sorry gravity will be center center in parent to make the layout in center true okay it's fine padding just for okay type text view okay web content prep content text will be screen width and after that id id will be screen width text view okay this is fine you can just increase some size of this i'm going to use sp for text view i will let you know the tell you in the next part of the display dependencies that why i have used uh, sp in text view there is a reason behind it Okay, sorry, I think the spellings are getting wrong. So, margin top will be 20 dp, and I'm going to use height. So, that will be just press control copy. Okay, find the screen size. Okay. In size text view is fine so we will need a button it will be match parent prep content id will be display matrix btn text get display matrix margin top say 40 dp okay this is fine so now we just need to press alt con alt control and alt for formatting the code so now just copy the ids come to your main activity file type text view just sorry just okay i think the whole text view was copied so just copy the id with copy come to your main activity file okay this is a good idea to copy the same id and set it at name variable so you can, you will not gonna be confused copy the display okay copy the button id 
come to sorry button okay now just type find your id r dot id dot okay so press control d to duplicate the values control v control v as you can see that we can simply find the ids just by our naming naming conviction so we will not gonna confuse so now just let me type a display metric dot set set on click listener new on click listener okay this is fine now i'm gonna create a helper class for getting the display metrics so display metric metrics helper Sorry. press control f6 so the control metrics okay so now first we need width so public static we will get the width in integer so get screen width okay so now we need here activity activity so first we need display metrics class to create an instance so new display metrics and then we will check that if our activity is not equal null then what we'll be gonna do is then activity dot get windows manager dot get display default display and then we will gonna get get metrics and then we will gonna just need to pass the display metrics instance and type return this uh, get metrics uh, method is in kind of void method which will get you the uh, display metrics so display uh, resolution so type here now we have our resolution of our default screen so type display metrics and type is width in pixels okay so here our here is our width and let me just copy here paste it here and just change the name g-i-g-s-g -G -G. okay this is fine now we just need to write in pixels okay now we, we just need to create a third method which is for screen in uh, screen size and for that we will need a formula so i'm going to create a method which will be name as public static double because the screen size will come in dot or decimal numbers so let get get screen size okay so and we will follow the same here okay this is fine so first what we are gonna need is we need same the display metrics here yeah? display metrics display metrics tab display metrics here yeah? and then just tap activity dot get windows manager dot get default display dot get metrics then just pass display metrics to get the display resolutions then type double and we will gonna need x dpi because the screen comes in uh, x and y for formation this is the x formation and this is the y formation from which is height and the uh, width we call x uh, x access so let me just get we will gonna use math class for the sgpi so we will gonna use the screen get with the screen and then activity then we'll just gonna divide it by display metrics dot xcpi and then we will gonna pass variable two just press control d and type y 
high dpi and pass screen height okay it this will be same so now create an another variable for screen size it will be math dot math dot s q r t which will get you the height and width pixels we we'll need to uh, okay plus sorry plus y dpi and then return math sorry then return in double will be math dot round screen inch screen size divide by 10 multiply by 10 and divide by 10 okay, okay. so here our methods are created successfully now let me just set the set it to the view so just type set text and then i'm gonna concatenate the so display metric helper dot get a screen width type main activity dot this okay okay uh I, we need to pass a string value so string dot value of okay just press control d for duplicating the values okay this is fine now we just need to change the methods name height and screen size okay okay this is fine this is totally fine so now let me just close this application so okay yeah, I mean, I have installed this application. Now we do not have this application, so I just pick. As you can see, that we now we can get the screen, different uh, screen width, height, and size. And the display. As you can see that we yeah, we got the successfully got the width, height, and the size. Let me just show you in uh, let me go in a different device. So run this. This is an uh, six inches phone, which is display size is five point five. I'm starting a new MVD, which is an uh, five inches phone and screen size is 4.4.5. Now, uh, let me just run this. And in the next, uh, don't forget to watch the next tutorial, which is about display density. This is an very this will be a great tutorial for your upcoming tuto uh, Android Android journey. This will be a great, oh, beneficial tutorial for you. So I wish you watch this one. So as you can see, we have successfully run our application. So as you can see that we got the screen width, height, and performance for screen sizes. So if you like the video, please do like, share and comment your quiz and don't forget to watch the next video about screen density, how it works, how we can use for different uh, devices, how we can use these dis uh, display depend uh, densities for uh, making the UI uh, re responsive and uh, comfortable and thank you.